Hello, good evening. It's the first week of May and it is distinctly chilly. Unfortunately, it will be staying that way through the rest of this week as well. But hang on in there. Next week, we should be talking about some warmer weather once again. For the next 24 hours, though, it's all about the wet and windy weather as this area of low pressure rolls in from the Atlantic. We will, I think, see pretty much uh, all of England and Wales getting off to a wet start to Wednesday. Uh, the cloud piling in and the rain to the southwest through the evening, eventually into South Wales. Much milder, though, as a consequence for England and Wales for first thing on Wednesday. Scotland, though, still with clear skies, with a risk of a frost, particularly across the northern half of the country. Not quite as sharp, though, I think, as last night when we got down to minus six. However, still plenty of cold air across Scotland to the north on Wednesday as the rain band pushes in from the south. We could see something wintry for a time. Very strong and cold winds feeding in off the North Sea as the weather front rolls north. It will be biting across eastern Scotland on Wednesday and those winds particularly gusty to the central belt of Scotland. Northern Ireland perhaps dodging some of the worst of the wet weather. Northeast of England though looking pretty soggy. To the south some sunny spells behind the front but then look out for some heavy thundery showers on Wednesday afternoon. So basically that low bringing us almost every type of weather but the kitchen sink on Wednesday. It will though start to pull out into the North Sea for Thursday. However, the tail end remains across the northern half of the UK. Still plenty of cloud around, still some wet weather, perhaps still some wintry weather for the Scottish mountains as well. And still disappointing temperatures, a nagging northerly wind behind that low for the northern half of the UK. To the south, 15 degrees with some sunshine, but it should feel reasonably pleasant. By Friday, the picture starts to improve significantly, though. The low pulls further out into the North Sea. There will be some showers around on Friday, but the wind will start to become lighter. We should see uh, more in the way of sunshine. Temperatures, though, still lagging. Figures below average for the time of year. But come the weekend, high pressure is going to start to build across the UK. A slow start for those temperatures creeping up. But by the time we get into the middle of next week, many of us could be looking at the high teens, even the low 20s eventually.